We're spending our last day at the wilderness or the last few hours at the wilderness at the lovely Wild Oats Market. This is one of our favorite places to come when we come to the wilderness because of the delicious food that they have. So we're going to be indulging in a lot of delicious food. So we've stopped by at the Slow Roast Coffee. Apparently they're really highly rated, really good coffee. So let's go take a look. We're having the dirty chai. Wow, that's so good. My God. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Hello. How many times are you doing? Can I please have uh, ten? Cinnamon and sugar. So these pancakes here are Josh's favorite. We've been here three years in a row and every time we come here he always comes for these pancakes and every time he comes here he buys more than 10 pancakes in one go. He just absolutely loves them. I don't know how they do it, but what they do it. It's incredibly delicious. It's the best pancake I've ever eaten. The Wild Oats Community Farmers Market was actually founded in 1999 by two hardworking ladies, Rose Brettel and Susan Garner. These two ladies living in the area realized that authentic country markets were becoming more and more scarce, despite the fact that they offered a really healthy community building opportunity. So we're gonna first dig into this delicious wrap. First, it just looks so pleasant to look at. It's basically a rice wrap filled with all sorts of veggies inside. Hey! Okay, come to my. Right, let's dig into it. So, as you bite in, you can taste the really crisp, fresh vegetables, carrots, all sorts of spinaches inside, sesame seeds. Wow, it's just a burst of flavor. Now, let's try this chia pudding. You can see there's tons of chia, blueberries, almonds, uh, what are these things? Pomegranates and bananas, just a whole bunch of delicious things inside. You mind if I take your photo? Mm. I think there's coconut yogurt inside as well. The coconut comes with... Mm, you want some fudge, right? <laughs> the coconut comes across super strong, but it's so good because it blends in well with the blueberries. And it's not super sweet, it's just like lightly sweeter, which is perfect for breakfast. How is that? You have some in your eye. <laughs> falafel wrap with um, coriander and chili and you can put your own toppings on afterwards with like coriander chili oil chilies they put tahini on it and you can add hummus and olives I mean ABBA <laughs> so I just had hummus and here we go incredible amount of flavor really delicious this is probably the most flavorful thing you can that you can order here Lastly, we're gonna taste this dessert. First, we got a fudge on this side, and then on this side, we got sort of like an energy ball, like a date ball with nuts and things like that. Let's try this chocolate fudge. It's so soft. Feels like ice cream, but like a cube. Sheesh, it's like a chunk of chocolate. It tastes like it's got, what is that thing called? Like a pink cordial? Super chocolatey, super rich. Delicious, but very, very rich. Now we have this energy ball. Mmm, very, very delicious. It's got mint inside with like nutty taste, and then of course chocolate coated. Do you gotta taste this? It's really good. So that food was really delicious, but now we're gonna head over to the other side of the market. They have a vegan restaurant there with some really delicious pastas, pizzas and dessert so let's go and try that out oh it seems like it's closed today last week when we came through i already ate so i didn't actually taste their food but i bought one of their custard tarts i got one of these vegan milk tarts <coughs> yeah. 
also want to taste. And it was such a delicious dessert. Oh my goodness, I was really looking forward to trying out their pizzas or their pastas, but it's just unfortunate they're not open today. We'll just have to come back another time. Time to get to the airport. Uh, hello. Hey, buddy. Yeah. Are you ready to go home, buddy? Come tell everyone what are we doing now? We're at the airport now and we're checking in. Yeah. Sir. Thank you kindly. There you go. Are you ready to go home? Very, very ready. A dirty chai oat latte? No, not latte, just dirty chai. It is a latte. Oh, it is a latte. Oh, this thing is stuck to this. I guess they don't expect you to wait 20 minutes to eat yeah. it. 